I've barely, barely touched on the next game, but I haven't seen anything yet of Oda's character development. So Sajima is a key person of interest in this case. Maybe he gets better, maybe he doesn't. I don't know, I'll have to play some more later. Let's find Earlier, out. the boss cited three points of suspicion against him, and I agree with her assessment. I checked the call logs of So's phones. Congressman Sajima has one phone under his name, and a burner phone rented under a fake name. Did you find anything interesting? Unfortunately, no. Really? But I do have something. I looked into So's secretary's phone. One call in particular stood out to me. Huh? It was one week ago. From Fuchu Prison. The caller identified themselves as inmate number 89. Number 89? Yes. This is most likely the same person who called HQ. I know killed Shogunadai. Hi, right, that guy. Wheel. The steering wheel. It's for steering. The dashboard. The dash. When you crash, the first thing you hit is the dash. Interesting. That better not be a fucking and thing they actually say at the DMV. I sort of fucking got it. And when you're in the hospital, you're gonna have to pay a lot of cash. <laughs> and if you don't have the cash, it's going to be your ass. That doesn't rhyme. No, but it's true. Gear shift. The gear shift. Date, can I move the shifter around? No! No, don't. Resist the urge. Besides, you can't even touch it. You're not really there. If it's in my head, I uh, get out of my head and into my eye hole. The glove box. This box is where you keep your doves. What? It's not a dove box. I got no say. What's behind us? The rearview mirror. Date, this reminds me of Egyptian mythology. Go on. Hathor, the mother of Ra. The mirror was one of her sacred symbols. Okay. Wasn't she Thanks. a cow or something? You didn't answer my question. Wait, was she a cow or something? Bitch, I'm a cow. Bitch, I'm a cow. Eh, I forgot how the rest went. Move. Bitch, I'm a cow. Oh, castle. And nothing was there. Alright. Well, hey, it could be worse for what's behind us. At least a set at least a pickup truck driver isn't right behind us. Yeah. With all those logs to final destination us. Yeah. Why so uh who's number 89? Who he and why does he sound like DC From Douglas? What he is an assassin. He accepts jobs from the criminal underworld for substantial rewards. His code name is Falco. Falco? Correct. That sounds familiar. Damn, I didn't know that some Smash Melee player couldn't, like, kind of lost his job as a like in the fighting game community and had to find work elsewhere. Must have been hungry box. So, uh, what's he in jail for? Murder. He is serving a life sentence for multiple counts. He was imprisoned six years ago. Six years ago. Six years. Six years ago. Hmm. Uh, what's his name? Unknown. You don't know? He is not registered in any databases. He could be a foreigner or recent immigrant, but it would be impossible to determine from where. However, I did not detect any accent in his speech. I believe we can conclude that he grew up in Japan. So, uh, what's 89 and So's relationship? Unknown. You would have to ask Mr. Sajima for that information. Let's go do it then. Number 89 and, um, said he knew who killed Shogo. Oh. He did. But that may be a lie. Does he have any connections to the Cyclops serial killings? Unknown. In all honesty, I have no idea. 
summarize it. Number 89. Should we visit Fuchu Prison? No. Sounds like a... We don't have time. Oh. Call up boss. Tell her to request that number 89 be brought to Abyss. Roger. This is a long ass highway that we're on. Yeah. It's, it's not even that much traffic. There... There's like no traffic at all. There's like two cars on the other side of the lane. I heard there was no body found at the cold storage warehouse. Isn't your investigation over? No, we still got some stuff to do. A garden lantern. Speaking of gardens, what kind do you prefer? I like a well manicured lawn. Yeah. But some bushes aren't bad either. I mean, what? Well, I mean, well, I mean, I prefer well. Tr I mean, yeah. I mean, some <laughs> bushes are meant to be trimmed. The uh, Sejima residence. Oh, well, would you look at that? A, a topiary. That's a big. A big green mochi. Green mochi. Actually, now that I look at it, it's uh, just a bush. A spherical bush. Perfectly. It's spherical! Spherical! Not emoji. No. Tree. Tree. Nope, nope, stop. Stone. Okay. A garden stone. Sure is. Pond. I have a look. A merman. So is a wealthy politician. It is no surprise to me that he has a merman. Wait, a merman? <laughs> oh, hey everybody! What? I'm a merman. <laughs> <laughs> I heard a strange voice just now. Could it be? A pond. Oh, hey. Yeah, I don't even want to. I don't even want to know what he gets up to with the merman. <laughs> There's a small island in the center of the pond. What else was there? Anything over here? Do, 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 just another lamp. No. Yeah, I think that's where I should hit her. Oh no, the bridge. Ooh, arch. It's an arch shaped stone over the bridge. Uh, over the pond. What the fuck? Yes, yeah, that. Whatever. It's so. He's feeding the koi in the pond. Yes! The koi. So about Iris. How many times do I have to tell you? I don't know that girl. I've never seen her before. Date. I knew he was lying. Yeah, he's lying. This proves it. I am having difficulty determining his motive for lying. After all, Iris was not killed. Maybe he's got a secret with her he doesn't want us knowing. A big secret. What are you hiding so? Let's see what else you're hiding. Uh, what? Why were you at the warehouse? I told you I will not answer that question. Bitch. And why not? We didn't find anything there. There's nothing to hide. It appears that he will not respond. So about eighty-nine. Number eighty-nine. Who is that? An inmate at Fuchu Prison. He used to go by Falco. He was an assassin. Odd, finding such a person in Japan. What about him? About a week ago, he called your secretary. I don't know anything about that. He was probably calling for a pardon or some such nonsense. My secretary probably decided it wasn't worth my attention. Okay, only one thing. Oh, oh, let's just press him on 89. Yeah. If you need information, you can ask her. I can't help you. No. All right. Uh, so what about Shoko then? Why did you call her? You are beginning to irritate me. You already what did you irritate want to talk to her me. About? What is the private matter you mentioned? What is your relationship with her? I'll answer your questions when you present a warrant. Bitch. <sighs> Told you, boss. Told you we should have gotten a Haven't you people award. got enough? I'm very busy. Excuse me. Oh, actually, I do have one more thing to tell you. To be honest, Kaname Date, 
I don't like you. I don't like you either. I don't either. ever want to see you again. My friend doesn't like you either. So I suggest that you don't show your face here anymore. It's what's best for both of us. Understand? Oh, well, the less I see of you, the better. So walked away sternly. Who does this guy think he is? Date, your blood pressure is skyrocketing. Any higher could kill you. <sighs> Relax, Date. We still have much to do. I know, I know. Well, well that's it. Got time to go back home. Go back to the old headquarters. The police headquarters, Monday at 2.49 p.m. Turn to Abyss HQ of Iba. I needed to talk to the boss. As I entered the room, the boss smiled, like she was waiting for me. I took care of what you asked for. Number 89? He's here. In the interrogation room. I'm on it. Yeah, You'll go without me this time. I have some errands to run. One of the higher-ups needs me. I'll have Pewter go to the interrogation with you. Okay, Understood. at least I'm not going alone. We're gonna have a fun time. Hmm, you look really? familiar. Very familiar. I wonder where you've seen him from. Hmm. Let's find out, shall we? Uh oh, uh oh. It's time to kick in. Let's get started. The man known as 89 is sitting right in front of me. De De desk in the middle of the room. Wait, is this just like that interrogation that we did with So? Kind of. But this won't in, like impact the story, will it? No, no, no. All all the story impact stuff is always insomnium, exclusively insomnium. The only thing that okay. The only thing that will change the stories is just like those gag endings, which there are like literally only I think two of them. And we just unlocked one of them. Yep. Wait till you find out what the other one is later. And I don't anyway, remember. 89. What's your name? Number 89. Your real name. Jackass. I don't know, I forgot. How do you forget your name? Very easily. Okay, That's well, where are you from? Djibouti. <laughs> Northeast Africa, a small republic of roughly 900,000. I don't take kindly to stupid lies. Don't look like you're from Northeastern Africa. That seems oddly random. Anyway, how many people have you killed? I don't know. It's not like I'm counting. And why'd you call Sojima's secretary? Oh, you know about that. It's true. I called Sojima's secretary. I got him on the line and I told him something very important. You spoke with him directly? Yeah. Did you tell him the secret of Dio's stand? I mean, if he did, he probably would be here with us right now. Oh, yeah, him? he'd be I getting... I told him to call somebody. He'd be getting donuts if that somebody. happened. Yeah. I can't tell you anymore. <sighs> Shoko's murder. Tell was me. it you? All right. Let's get back to the topic at hand. Well, he couldn't have done it. He was literally in jail. We are just now grabbing him. Two days ago, you called our investigation office. You said you know who killed Shoko Nadami. Maybe That's he did right. it remotely. Who? Hey, don't be so hasty. We haven't agreed on a deal. You're gonna let me out of prison, right? Yes, I promise. <laughs> You're lying. You don't want to release me. That's fine. I was expecting this anyway. I just wanted a good excuse to leave the prison. What do you mean? You really want to know? 
Here's what I mean! Uh oh. Oh, oh no! Oh. Seriously? Ow! Pewter! Pewter! Help! Help! Just stood there and did nothing. Oh. Now he can't do anything. You'll make a good hostage for me. Take Thank me to the exit. Now. Wow, Pewter, you're so helpful. You think Such he would have had a gadget good on him? Friend. Yeah, or at least some other weapon. <laughs> Police headquarters, Monday at 4.06 p.m. A couple hours later. Oh, darn. Darn? Are you kidding me? A criminal serving a life sentence just escaped from Metro Police. I ordered everyone to keep quiet about this, but it's only a matter of time before the press sniffs this out. We need to get number 89 back before then. Oh, shit just got real. Mario, what do you Mario, about let's say you. I wanna go to Suzuki. Same here. Not now, Mario! There's a cr there's a serial killer on the loose. <laughs> Spiking is oh. an important part of volleyball. Hmm. Spiking. Spike... Spike Chun? What is that? That better not be exactly that... how they got their name. That'd be funny. Better. That's called... That's called breaking the fourth wall. Just, just a little bit. Just, just, just cracking the wall. Just a little bit. Wait a minute. Did you let number 89 escape on purpose? So that you could catch the bigger fish? What? Yes. Yeah, boss. Exactly. <laughs> I was kidding. Damn. Oh man, now that we have another character here, we can have more dialogue of stupid shit in the background. <laughs> bags bags the hanging on the rack. Inside the bag. The colorful hand... Ah. Oh my... Oh, boss. <laughs> boss. Powder whips and handcuffs. That's a lot of bags. Date, pewter. Once we're done here, let's pop that bottle. Not yeah. a bad idea. But when the boss gets drunk, she has the tendency to crush balls. Jesus Christ. In that case, perhaps we should never solve this case. Good call. Let's just walk out the door right now. Oops. I really like chairs. They look delicious. Not where I expected that to go. What the hell are you what? talking about? I don't know if leather's a good thing for you to eat. But no keyhole for it. Same as you, Date. What do you mean by that? Shut up, Peter. Shut the fuck up, Peter. Like Krim does escape and shit. The Timothy statue. Good. No. Yeah. A shogi player gave that to me. I think his name was... Hanyu? The Hanyu? Yep, that's him. <coughs> okay, hey, and... the joke here I'm not getting. <clears throat> oh, really? Okay. I thought it definitely would have been something with the coffee this time. type of computer so much. Uh, same. Like, if you're just using it for purely office stuff, then sure. But you can't have it as a home computer. I mean, for real. A kid would easily fuck that up. Damn right. I want to knock you over the head with that snowboard right about Jesus. now. Then allow me to say this. I will slalom away from that attack. Not funny. Pyodor, you failed to keep a criminal from escaping, so shut the fuck up. Who earns? Date, look! A UFO? That's a symbol. It could be a symbol for UFOs. Boss, I turned your stationary bike into a coffee grinder. You use the pedals to grind the beans. Why the hell did you do that? I mean... All he did was just add a feature, honestly. Was anything actually taken away? Or 
reminds me of your ex, Dante. Okay. <laughs> I have an ex? It shouldn't. Coat hanger. Yep. Blaster, Blaster figure. figure. They were kind and had a big smile. Such a shame. <laughs> oh, that's um, right. Her axe. Or something. Why does she have a plaster statue of her ex? Ah, uh, yeah. All right, let's get to talking. Where's my gun? Peter? Where's? Yeah, where? Yeah, where is his gun? Number eighty-nine still yeah, has it. Does. But don't worry, I have a spare. I'll give it to you later. Okay, but that doesn't help. We got not only do we have a serial killer on the loose, but we have an armed serial killer on the loose with sick-ass bullets. Now, how did he get away? How did he get away? He punched out an officer and stole his clothes. He put on the uniform and brought me with him at gunpoint. Well, he had the gun in his pocket, uh, hiding it. No one on the floor even knew this was happening. He got on the elevator and made it to the ground floor. He even stole my security card. He said he'd kill me if I tried anything. I suppose the whole escape took him about uh, five minutes. He must have planned this. You're rather calm about all this. I'm coming down from being terrified for my life. I'm in a bit of a fugue state right now. All right. Where where is he? Where is 89? How would I know? After he got to the exit, he let me go. I didn't see where he went. I collapsed right there. Thanks a lot, Peter. Apologize. Boss, it's my fault he got away. I'm sorry. Don't waste time apologizing. Go catch him. I'm the one who has to go on an apology tour now. <sighs> you really messed up this time. Okay, but so did Pewter. He was he didn't do anything to stop him. Yeah, all he did was just look pretty. Dante, I know you are already aware of this, but there are security cameras all over this compound. I checked all of them. Number 89 fled in a car that was waiting for him. So he had an accomplice? Yes. Did you see who was driving? I did. Who was it? You and I know him well. Uh-oh. Dun-dun-dun. Dun-dun-dun! Wow. Told Boss and Peter what Iba revealed to me. Renju? Why? So now you reacted, Peter. Date, Moma is home. Moma? From the Kumakuras? The very same. Okay, what, is he, what does he want? Hey, Dante. I just got the word. Renju's been seen. What? Where? Hey, don't forget our deal. Deal? What deal? You forgot already? I'm talking about Tessa. Oh, right. I'll be waiting. You know what to do. What should we do? We have no choice. We have to take her. To MoMA? Yes. Well, shit. This just got even more complicated. Fun times are to be had now. Lemnis Gate. Monday, 4.43 p.m.